Would it be the Ivory Coast or would it be Zambia? Our friends, the Ivory Coast, once again playing in the Tangerine Strip. Early on in this game, it's Ivory Coast with a header against the Woodwork. Zambia then caught completely cold on two minutes. Lucky to see that header from Traore come back from the post and then having their goalkeeper to thank for that initial save. And Traore, the number 10, putting the rebound wide. Ivory Coast went into this match without the injured Fofana, but he'd promised to be fit for semi-final duty, hoping his teammates could do the business here and qualify for the final four. Zambia may have been the underdogs, but they were certainly not out to make things easy for Ivory Coast. Keeping them for much of the first half at long range. Well prepared by their trainer, Sam Endlove. Chabala in goal, doing all that was asked of him. And when he was caught out of position, defenders in the right position to clear the danger. But as you see from these pictures, it was Ivory Coast with most of the pressure in the first half. Zambia's best chance really spurned when they uh, chose to knock the ball back instead of heading for goal, inexplicably so. And then getting forward, it's the defender Soko who drives just wide of the upright. Nil-nil then at halftime. We turn around into the second half. Real chances few and far between. When they come your way, you've got to make them count. Zambia failed to do so. Eindhoven, the Ivory Coast well aware of the danger man and he was kept relatively quiet as Ivory Coast go close once again with a shot that's cleared from the line. But as the minutes tick by towards the end of normal time, still neither side can find a way through. to extra time before at last it was Ivory Coast who broke the stalemate this coming in the 93rd minute well the camera following our friend Traore there he looks delighted and after the match was quick to claim the goal but at the time we thought it was Sia shot that took a wicked deflection as the free kick there rebounds to the edge of the box and Chabala last is beaten in the cruelest of manners. See a shot then taking a huge deflection from a Zambian defender and Ivory Coast finally have the lead. This coming remember in the first period of extra time after the sides have finished at 90 minutes nil nil. then with success built on a stern defense see off Zambia at the end of extra time 